London. Evacuation. More than 2,000 people streamed out of the city's tallest building, the 395-foot-high British Petroleum Headquarters. It took 15 minutes. Good going, according to the experts. It was all an exercise which assumed that an airliner had crashed into the top two stories, killing at least four people and injuring a large number. Every effort was made to create as realistic an effect as possible. Ambulances and fire engines were quickly on the spot as alarm bells were rung warning the staff to get out. As the staff made their exit, all lifts were stopped, the emergency services went into action. Firemen played foam onto a nearby tower where a wing of the plane was supposed to have fallen. Aviation fuel was another imaginary hazard. Office workers cooperated by acting as the injured in this, the most extensive emergency exercise ever held in the city. From the point of view of the authorities, the calamity exercise was a big success. Everything went according to plan. Such a disaster could happen. Better to be prepared, even if it was play acting. At the